Hey everybody, here we are on continuing our round Britain whiz. We're at a place called Maypole Airfield in northern Kent and we're just going to fly around the uh, eastern edge of Kent and check out the White Cliffs of Dover and then stop at a nearby uh, another airstrip that's nearby and then it's just all south coast into Southampton um, which we'll do over a few flights so let's get airborne Start by going northeast and just go around the coastline. The wonderful thing about living in Kent is it's so well connected. Um, we've got the cross channel ferries and uh, Eurostar uh, to get to the continent, and then it's also a short train journey into London uh, to the London airport. Don't get anywhere from London. Margate and Ramsgate on the far eastern tip. Yeah, you can basically see uh, that's it, that's all of Kent really. That's the English Channel there, North Sea there, James Estuary there. These fields look quite wintry. The photo must have been taken at winter, some of them. Oh, those yellow ones, uh, that's normally mustard or something, and that's uh, rapeseed. And that would be May. Some dark green fields, that's probably early wheat crops in May. Maybe these brown fields are just ones that were left fallow the summer. I'm quite ignorant of farming so please do correct me. Um, there's a little airfield there you can just see. Um, I'm signposted it might be a military field. All right so what have we got coming up? Birching to not see. by Westgate on sea, followed by Margate. I've just come off a fantastic uh, city tour of Paris. The new update for has dropped. Um, Amsterdam is uh, like London. It was rendering slowly and uh, looked a bit bombed out. But Paris looked good. If it was a bit jerky though, it's getting frame rate problems. Probably getting bombed on the server side as well with everyone testing, checking out Paris. Golf course by the sea. can't hear that, I'm just having a cup of tea. Um, the microphone I use is pretty bad and it doesn't pick up sounds like that, so if it does I do apologise. You 
is Margate. Nice beach there. Eastern extremity of the United Kingdom. Southeastern extremity, extremity at least. I think Yarmouth might be further east than here. Or East Anglia. Passing underneath our um, elevator there, the rudder is um, Joss Bay. Looks like a popular beach. Another nice thing about Kent is I believe the housing's quite cheap as well. At least in Dover it is when I was there looking at, in an estate agent window. Much more affordable than in uh, Southampton. So we're at a place called Broadstairs and then you can see the little port there of Ramsgate at about two o'clock. the coast, towns of Sandwich, Deal, Walmer, and eventually we'll get to Dover, which should be pretty unmistakable. Yeah, big runway that, must be a military base. See the town of Sandwich probably just in front of our nose there. And then Deal, slightly off the left wing.
might be able to see the coast of France um, just on the left wing tip just go straight up to the horizon I think I can see something there almost on the horizon Definitely France there, up above the left wing on the horizon. Um, and the POI indicator for Dover has popped up. That's the airfield we're landing, Channel Gliding Club. Just going to go out to sea so we can see the white cliffs properly and then come back in on that airport. Dover before on my uh, Southampton to Alaska flight before the World Update 3 when there would have just been a, a beige slope into the sea. They're vertical this time. But why are they green down to the uh, ground? They're too green. this won't do. You're going to have to sort this out Microsoft. The only real improvement I see is that they're vertical this time. Oh, nope, something's loading. Or they're just slow loading. Still green. What are those trees at the bottom? Even growing up the side. I 
Oh, wow. What about that? That's more like it. It's just a slow lo server loading problem. Let's do a little loop. Get a better look. Much better. Oops. There we go. All right, let's bring it in over Dover. And land at the Channel Gliding Club. they don't have hovercrafts going across to France anymore. They, once the Channel Tunnel line came along, they just weren't cost effective. The Channel Tunnel, it's 30 minutes to France. And that was how the hovercrafts competed with the ferries on speed. The only place I know of now where you can get a hovercraft is to the Isle of Wight from South Sea. And I've done it, I've done it quite recently, and it is cool. It is worth doing. Ferries are still fun for crossing the channel though, if you're trying to decide if you're not pushed for time and um, you want something a bit more interesting than just a black tunnel, take the ferry. Go out on the deck, take the fresh air really windy. Hang out with the truckers. Okay, so we're just going to go into a left-hand circuit. a bit actually. Looks like the photo of a little glider at the front of the runway there, just flat on the ground. Doing a perfect glide approach myself.
and we're down. Alright, hope you enjoyed that, and uh, see you on the next video.